Hi, this is Mukul, and in this video, I will show you a Danish gambit trap. Uh, this trap is for white, and white can use it when he opts for Danish gambit. So, what is Danish gambit? It is easy. We have like this e4, e5, and after d4, it is sent again. Pawn takes pawn, and after c3, we have Danish gambit. Pawn takes pawn, and now instead of taking with the knight, white will develop his bishop. Pawn takes pawn, and now it is compulsory for white to capture that pawn. d6, and now white should develop his knight. It looks quite sensible. Knight to f6, and when you have something like this you should push the pawn and attack the knight if pawn takes pawn now it's your chance to capitalize on the on the sacrifices made by you how to how can you do that bishop takes pawn on f7 check if king takes bishop then black will lose its queen so king must go to e7 square and now bishop a3 check and king has no space to move king must take that bishop and king will take it white wins the queen so i hope you like this trap and white has enough compensation for the sacrifice use it when you have position like this or like this only then this trap will work. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.